Was it like overwhelming? I don't know. I was. Are you nervous? We were following the live stream yesterday, so we were planning on coming to the academy on Friday, but when we heard it bloomed, we were like, we got it, we got to go. Yeah. First thing in the yeah. morning when they open, yeah. so <laughs> here we are. <laughs> I smell the sweaty feet, sort of sweet, Snicker. pungent, kind of like your shin guards Shins. after soccer. <laughs> I was able to move some meetings around and make it out to try to get a smell of the corpse flower before it kind of faded back away. I don't know if I got as much as the smell. I think in certain directions I definitely picked up on the like sweaty socks, sweaty gym clothes, but probably luckily not like full on rotting meat, but still like definitely a smellier plant than average. Yeah, so the aroma is kind of stinky. People have described it as like garlic or rotten flesh or feet. Um, and the reason this flower smells this way is because it's pollinated by flies. So it's kind of imitating the smell of kind of a dead carcass to kind of get all the flies to come and interact with it, pick up pollen, and then take that pollen to another flower that it might investigate due to its smell. <laughs> Um, it also has a really weird blooming cycle, so it'll only bloom once every seven to ten years. So seeing one blooming is actually a very interesting experience. Um, it's absolutely beautiful, um, and it also has a unique aroma that I think people are slightly curious about, even though it's a bad smell. <laughs> <laughs>